on my way home, I had a pretty good day at work, I have to say. So now, um, well, I'm trying to get home. The traffic's really crappy, so you guys can see. I normally film while I drive, but hey, you know. Well, I mean, I don't normally film out the front window when I drive. <laughs> anyway, I always film when I drive. What am I talking about? Um, the traffic's pretty bad tonight, so I'm going to try to go home, and I don't know what we're doing tonight. Don't have a clue. I probably won't know until I get home. I'm sure my wife's not going to feel like going and eating anything because she got her top races on today. So, let's see how she's feeling when I get home. I'm sure she's probably hurting pretty bad, so I doubt she's going to want to go do anything or go out to eat. I'm sure she's going to want to sit at home and maybe have some ice cream or something because I know when I got my top, my bottom ones on, it hurt like hell. I, when I got my top ones on, it hurt too, but I have my top ones on first. And uh, when I got my bottom ones on, it hurt pretty bad. And it's still pretty bad because I've never gotten sores or anything on the inside of my mouth uh, from the top braces. It's usually the bottom ones. And I started doing this thing. It's weird. I don't know if you guys can notice it in the videos, but from time to time I feel like I can't talk like my lips won't move correctly because of the braces and I don't know if it's because my teeth are moving or if it's rubbing I know my bottom one's rubbing right now and it's hurting really bad but sometimes I feel like I can't talk like my mouth doesn't want to move correctly and I'm hoping that's just a side effect of the braces and it happens but uh, it seems to have gotten worse here lately I don't know if you guys noticed or not. I notice it when I talk that it's different and it feels different and it's not as comfortable to talk. So, who knows? You know, with me, it's always something strange or weird going on with me. So, that's pretty much par for the course. Oh, but the inside of my mouth does hurt really bad. So, I don't know what we got on tap for this weekend. It's supposed to rain. I don't know if that's going to happen. If we're going to do garage sales, I don't have the slightest clue on what's going to happen. I guess it all really depends on if it's going to rain or not. Um, we need to pull stuff out tomorrow and get it priced. I really wish we had a really long tent and we would just put it in the driveway and put everything underneath there and do a rain or shine thing. I just can't afford to buy a really big tent, even though I'd love to have one. You know, just like a big long canopy. We just have a 10 by 10 and it wouldn't be enough for all the stuff. So, you know, at some point in time, we gotta start getting rid of all of that and going through the house and getting rid of stuff out of the house. You know, trying to sell it and if we can't sell it, just take it to Goodwill or someplace like that and get rid of it. Um, just because if we move to another house, I don't wanna take a bunch of crap that we're never gonna use. It's never gonna find its place in the house. There's no point in taking it and then trying to sell it once we move. It's just easier to get rid of it where we're at and not have to pay to move any of it, so. But if all else fails and we can't have a garage sale, I'll be piling all that in the garage, uh, made space so I could get it all in there. So that's probably where it'll end up. And if it does rain, I'll try to get something done video wise if it's i try to get some game stuff done i'm really waiting for i'm going to start doing some minecraft stuff again and getting back into minecraft a little bit uh, but i'm waiting for there's supposed to be like a 1.8 update somebody was telling me about so i'm going to wait until that new update comes out and just redo all my minecraft stuff and then um, i have some other games i can play and do some gameplay on and i still have the elgato i just don't have it hooked up it's something else I need to do and just play something on PlayStation 3 and record it. So, um, you know, it's it's a matter of finding time to actually get it all done. God, my mouth is just acting so weird today. And it's not like it goes numb. It just feels weird. Like I can't talk. Like my mouth just wants to shut down and I can't talk. And I don't know what it is. So, like I said, who knows? It's always, I always got something going on, something weird. So anyway, I'm gonna try to get out of this traffic and get home. 
All right, so I'm showing you guys the garden. This is, I think we figured out this is yellow zucchini. I don't know, this is squash. And then the yellow zucchini is over there. And these are cucumbers. You can see that little piece right there. It's looking for something to grab onto. So I got to make these uh, hoops that go all the way across and then put netting and then they'll connect up. There's my onions. Those are green beans or snap beans. They're starting to, to flower. There's some uh, tomato plants that came up and then of course there's the spinach and then whatever that is way over there. Hi Tucker, that's Tucker. Say hi. Speak, speak. He doesn't feel like being a show dog tonight. <laughs> This is the one I call turkey. And then there is the yellow squash. And if you look, it's already starting to flower. And back inside there, there's some squash already being made. Let's see. Let's see, there's a squash right there. So that's what we got so far. It's starting to look really good. It's starting to get better. And I think this last rain helped it a ton because everything underneath the plants is still soaking wet. So I think we'll probably hold off watering tonight and water tomorrow. And because um, the ground's still really damp underneath, it's just dry on top. So anyway, I think we're gonna go get something to eat because I feel like crap, my blood sugar's starting to drop. So we're gonna go run and get something to eat and then I'm gonna edit and get ready for bed because I'm tired. All right, so I'm calling it a night. Um, Help my wife in the yard. Um, after I showed you guys the garden, got all the uh, goats settled in, chickens settled in, and then um, helped her finish mowing, and then took an outside shower, about froze my ass off. Because uh, by the time it was my turn, I wasn't hot and sweaty anymore, and that water was freaking cold, but still got a good clean shower out of it. So tomorrow's Friday. I'm going to try to go to bed early tonight, and I'm going to sleep in. Hopefully, if it's raining Saturday, I'm sleeping in. If not, I think we're having a garage sale. So we just have to wait and see what the weather's going to do. So, But uh, other than that, that's all I got for Thursday. I'm going to go relax and uh, watch a little TV and eat and go to bed. So thank you guys for watching. Um, if you're new to the videos, make sure you hit subscribe. If there's something you see or hear that you like, hit that like button. Uh, you can leave me a comment on a video, leave me a message on YouTube. You can find me on Twitter. The official Twitter is YouTube underscore Frank. My personal one is Frank underscore is underscore fun. That's the same as my Instagram account. account. So just let me know that you guys uh, watch my videos and I will follow you back. Um, thank you guys for watching. I hope you had a wonderful Thursday. Mine wasn't too bad. I'm glad for it to be over and tomorrow's Friday. And I'll see you all tomorrow.